cold weather didn't keep the more than 30 students who signed up from participating in a cardboard village simulation that was outside on Hagenfield this weekend. The smaller you make it, the closer we're all going to be. They built their shelters for the night using cardboard and duct tape that the Center for Community Outreach provided. I was like, we're going to make like a, a floor almost and then tape it all together and then like bend up the side. The event was part of National Hunger and Homelessness Awareness Week and lasted from 5 Friday night to 10 Saturday morning. <laughs> we're uh, we're yeah. probably going to have a roof on top of our I think we are too. Yeah. Nursing student Chance Wall says the event didn't represent exactly how the homeless are forced to live, but it's the closest he's been to it. I don't think it's exactly like it. I mean, it's probably the best representation that you could possibly do. Um, like I said, I've never done this before, so it's certainly going to be an experience for me. But to be truthfully honest, it's probably not the same that they experience. Wall says choosing to be homeless for a night made him realize exactly how fortunate he is to have a home. He wants to get more involved in helping out those in need. I'm Kristen Martin reporting for WRFL.